So this is a roadway, this is a bridge, right? There's a person on the bridge, right? The way a beam works is that all the forces translate and then they go down into the column, right? So let's say that we want to span a longer bridge, a longer distance, right? You're gonna need something stronger because as this bends, right, this mm -hmm. begins to bend up. That's deflection, right? So in order to counteract deflection, right, you're going to need to increase the size of the beam, mm -hmm. right? So what do you do when the distance is so long, right? You have to build a really, really big beam. Mm. Right? Right? That's to keep the deflection down. Mm. So the idea is that all of this load, it eventually gets transferred mm. by the beam across down. But let's say the person is here, right? And then the person is here. This is one, two, two persons, right? Twelve feet very big beam, mm -hmm. right? So when this beam is this big, what do the engineers do, right? And this is where you show a picture of Swiss cheese, right? Because it looks like, uh, this is a bad drawing of a brioche, right? Holes, Swiss cheese, right? You start taking materials out. So what do the engineers do? they start taking out materials, right? To make this beam. But the problem is that when you have a square and a square, right? And a square, this moves around. So it's not stable. So for this, you see that this moves, this moves. So what do the engineers do, right? They still remove the material, right? But they stabilize it with a truss, right? Mm. So this then, right? This is now very stable because the loads, they go from here to here, down, and then they all get transmitted mm. down like this. Same thing. It's very stable, mm. like this, very stable, okay? See how it bends mm -hmm. a lot, right? Mm -hmm. It bends and then it breaks. But then for this one, see? Look at how much more it can carry before it bends. Oh, this right 
here is not a secure bridge because if you just simply hammer it down, it can compress it. So if you have this, then, and you put it right here, this does not allow it to, uh, to smush because this and this, this is a solid structure. It holds two of these together. When we smushed it, it, it made these two come together. So now that this is securing it, it will not happen. See how it... This is the truss bridge. It is made out of spaghetti straws and we hot glued the pieces together. It is held by cups and it could hold two spaghetti jars. Weight is 24 um. ounces and 680 grams. <laughs> Ooh, let's see if this could actually hold it. Will it crash or will it hold? Dun, dun, dun. Thank you.